of Slossin. I'm Katie Spencer. You do you got a uh, uh, business you represent? Yeah, Solid Black Apparel clothing brand. All right, bet, 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 bet. Right, right. So, um, who who is KD? Where, like, if you could tell us, like, KD is a. Uh, I'm an entrepreneur, businessman, uh, ghetto advocate. Uh, I'm like the dude you call and holla at when you're trying to know two sides. Like you're trying to, let's say you trapped in the mind frame of, I don't want to be in the ghetto, I want to be in the hood, however you portray the, the image to, I need to better myself. I need a job, I want to go to school, or I need to learn a trade or something of that nature. A lot of people call me on that because I didn't kind of wiggled in both areas. You know what I'm saying? So I know how to like, give advice, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Where are you from? I, I represent Los Angeles as a whole. I was uh, I was born in the West Adams community that's in, in, over there in the low bottoms in like the 20s and all that. Grandma, you know, born in, um, you know, this is 85 and uh, on Butt Long, you know, <laughs> Granny had the big old house over there. It's a historic community, a lot of old houses. Um, you know, everybody know this story that's from over there in that area. My granny house burnt down, some things happened. When her house burnt down, we moved to Lomita, to the Harbor Hills Projects, and that's, I grew up from there. Still going to LA and shit, but you know, I grew up predominantly over there, and you know, going back with moms and them, because moms and them grew up over there, you know, so we always had that connection with that community as well. Okay, and, and what, like, what generation would you say you represent? The generation? Uh, like what year in high school you leave? Uh, leave LA? No, what like what high school class are you? Oh, I'm in a what was that? Two thousand four? Yeah, two thousand four. Norbon High School. What's that? Uh, it's like that's like I think that's yeah. Norbon is like Harbor City. And Norbon back in them days, it's nice now. <laughs> a lot of niggas don't know that. Norbon is nice now. When we was at Norbon, Norbon was cracking. Because uh, you had, at the time, the projects was lit in Lomita at that time. It was on fire. Then all the dudes from Harbor City, and then you had everybody from L.A. It was like a, a melting pot. And then what people don't know is a lot of the people in the projects, everybody was like from somewhere else. Compton, L.A., their family just moved over there just like how my family did. So it's like all these dudes in this area, then you got these dudes, then you got just other people just coming from getting kicked out of, they might have went to Dorsey and they, you know, now they're going to Norbon and or they might have went to Compton High. They going, they coming from all these different schools to Norbon because Norbon had a good uh, basketball team and a football team. So it's like, and it's, it's in Harbor City. So people are like, I want to go there. Mm -hmm. Then when they get there, it's cracking too. They're like, damn. <laughs> so, like, so, you know, it's one of them things. Who was it like? Like any notable stories, is there any notable characters um, at this high school around the time that you grew up at that you could tell us about that? Like, you know, just throwing us a typical Norbon story with some notable characters. Like no niggas who got names right now. Yeah, that yeah. You went to uh, my boy Dito, Deshaun Goldston. Uh, he had went to the 49ers. He went to a couple teams, but he was, he was mainly known for being on the 49ers. That's the homie right there. Uh, Couple other cats did some things too. Uh, my boy Amir, he uh, I ain't seen him in years though, but he went to uh, he went to well, he went to Fleming, he went to Norbon too. He I forgot what team he on, but he in the NBA. Tall ass Amir, skinny dude. I think he like Jamaican or something. Uh, he went. A uh, couple other cats, I can't remember everybody. Then this other little youngster, he just went to. Can't remember this team, but he just got drafted to some football team that we know. Mm -hmm. So it's it's been a little, you know, little stuff. And like Tiger went to uh, Norbon, he was my little brother. Uh, I had left already by then, but you know, different people went up there. It's, it's, a, it's a cool amount of people that did something, you know, that blew up or whatever you want to call it. I went up there. 